Hey, guys, ghouls, royals, and rebels. Today I will show you my Ever After High slash Monster High collection at a glimpse. For the Monster High dolls, I will not be naming every single one of these 98 dolls. Yes, there's 98 of them. Um, I will just be, um, I will just be pointing out a few newer ones. So, you can take a, a glimpse right now. First of all, we will talk about Ever After High. So, here is the lovely um, rooms that aren't actually very nice. They're just wood, but <laughs> maybe we'll be able to touch that up sometime. Um, so here are all four of the dolls that are released. There will be an Ashland Hunter 2-pack and Legacy Day dolls. All of these dolls will be in Legacy Day, except for Maddie. But I'm pretty, but I'm confident that they'll make a 3-pack with Maddie in it. I'm confident. I hope they do. Cross your fingers, guys. So, now I'll show you all the girls. This is Apple White. She is the most fabulous of them all. By the way, I watched some episodes right now. <laughs> yeah. She loves apples. And she hopes she gets her happily ever after, after Raven Queen decides what she wants to do. She is going to rewrite destiny. She will decide to be nice and not follow her parents footsteps. Hmm. I smell some trouble. Now, here we have some more of the girls. Here we have Briar Beauty and Maddie Hatter. Madeline Hatter. Briar Beauty is Apple White's best friend till the end. And instead of sleeping for 100 years, she will to get her happy ending. But she is gonna live it up now. All right. <laughs> oh gosh. Uh, all right. So here is Maddie Hatter, or Madeline Hatter. She is daughter of the Mad Hatter, and OMG, I love her. I love how she looks. I just love everything about her. So she is definitely going on the favorite list. No thumbs. I would do triple if I had three thumbs. And this girl's off quick. Claudine. I'm starting to forget the names now. Um, um, school girls Claudine, but, but, all right. So, I'm going to show you some new Monster High dolls that I didn't review over the summer. So, let's start talking. I have got Gigi Grant. made a custom Gigi Grant for Haunt the Cosba, and you may notice this layer. Aha! It's really hard to see, but oh god. Ah, this is like crazy. Oh my gosh. Um, stay like that, whatever. She's making a turn. <laughs> Looks like she's making a turn on her horse. Oh my gosh, it's so scary. But we used Frankie. Oh, here's um, big skirt, and now oh, she looks like that. I think it was an awesome edit. We also got some 13 wishes. Then, um, I'm trying to think of what to talk about. Um, let's see. So, I'm gonna pop up here. Um, most of it's over here. We also got the Harpy and Siren um, add-on packs. We used the witch pieces and the, um, oh god, <laughs> that was like complete failure. Um, and the, um, that is, um, where, where we used for that? I think that was, um, that was like, I forget what that was. I think that's the, I'm pretty confident that 
those were the vampire pieces. Not vampire, um, dragon. Ah, I'm getting so mixed up with my dolls. Um, trying to look. Okay. <laughs> well, that seems like just about it that I wanted to talk about with you guys. Um, thanks for watching. Um, say if you like Ever After High or Monster High better. Um, yeah. Like, comment, and subscribe to my channel, which is K Girl T Love. And bye!